Hey Shugs, welcome back. This is Laura with Anxiety Art Adventures. Wee! Okay, I'm going to be doing an unboxing today from Craftably. Full disclosure, I am a Craftably affiliate. You can find all that information in the description down below. If you'd like to use codes, great. If not, totally understand. Will not offend me one way or the other. So, um, I ordered a pre-orders through Craftably and they were nice enough to put this in with the pre-orders and when I opened all my pre-orders I was like wait a minute I didn't order this what's going on here but Craftably was nice enough to send this to me so I want to show this to you all so this is Raven Moon from Julia Watkins oh yes oh yes I am very excited to look at this kit because it has special drills it has glow-in-the-dark drills and Gotta figure out how to open this box. This is Craftably's new boxes, by the way. Um, has the image on the front with the artist and all of that on the back. Gives you all the kit features. There's beautiful Miss Amy. Um, what is diamond painting? You know, testimonials, all that. They are a Texas-based company. They are a physical store in Texas. So if you are anywhere near, um, where are they in Texas? They are Fort Worth, Texas on Camp Bowie Boulevard. Go check out Craftably. All right, y'all are gonna hear my cats because of course when I turn the camera on, they think it's about them. So yes, they are play fighting. All right, we've got our beautiful Craftably toolkit here. Toolkit, <clears throat> excuse me. All right. You got your purple everything in here. I'm not gonna open this, but you got a purple tray, purple squishy, diamond painting pen, and purple tweezers. Yes, ma'am. And I'm pretty sure, yes, there are some uh, multi-placers, thin white multi-placers in there. That is the basic toolkit. And then you get extras, extras, oh boy. Get washi tape. Ooh, I got some Christmas themed washi tape. Come on, camera. Okay, you get the gist. <laughs> um, you get some wax in their branded caddy. Just some pink wax. Then you get a cover minder, yes. I can never get these open. There we go. Oh, because they're taped. That's all right, I'm gonna break the tape. Oh no, it came off, that's okay. I can glue it back on, no big deal but it's a heart cover minder with little stars in it. How cute. All right. So you get all of that in your little tool kit. And I use these burlap bags. I keep uh, multi-placers in them as well as uh, wax. So very helpful. All right. Um, definitely check out Craftably's site. I will of course have the link down below. They have a bunch of new things on their site. Um, one thing in particular, which I am excited about um, trying is paper quilling. Uh, so I definitely wanna go ahead and order that soon. Order that soon, where are my scissors? You gotta be careful when you do this so you don't cut the canvas. All right, I'm just gonna pull that tape off. The back is soft, soft lint, so the tape it sticks, but not to the point where you can't get it off. All right, all right. All right, I'm gonna have to roll this the other way. So, uno momento, you can do this with poor glue canvases, not with double-sided adhesive or mounting foam. No, no, no shook. This is a perfect canvas for this time of year. It's got a, you know, kind of a Halloween-y feel to it, but it also has, um, to me, it has a nice wintry feel as well. There we have it, look at that. That is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Of course, the artist is Julia Watkins. Again, this is an 18 by 18, so it's not a very large painting, which I am a fan of, am a fan, however, you will be surprised on this painting, because it is a little bit smaller, 
There are 66 colors. Look at that. 66 colors, you guys. Wow. It might help if I had my autofocus on. Wow. Okay. Yeah, there we go. 66 colors. Look at that image. Raven Moon. It is a round drill cut, you know me, and, and rounds, love rounds. And all of these are individual stickers that you peel off and can put on containers or on baggies. This one was actually came pre-bagged, which hallelujah. I love pre-bagged because I work out of bags. I know some people don't. I do because I've got, um, you know, containers that I can just set the bags in and go. So, yay. I am surprised there's 66 colors, but look at some of these drills. Look at those special drills. They're larger drills, like crystals. We're gonna get into that. We're gonna get into that. Okay. So yeah, that's your inventory sheet. And you get your craftably, this is just a how to diamond paint. Um, welcome to the craftably family, customer service. Their customer service is phenomenal. Um, highly recommend, highly recommend. Okay, wow. All right, let's do a sticky test. Love that sound, love that sound. All right. And I do like the fact that there, this plastic is very thick. I like that because it's not as easy to tear when you're working on it. Okay, on both sides of the canvas, both sides, you have a key code. Love it, love it. So that way you can reference key code on either side that you're working on. Uh, yes. Oh, this is so pretty. All right, let's look at the drill field. Come on camera. Very clear, very clear. Can you all see that? Very clear. Look, look at the eye. I hope that there's some, yeah, there's a special drill in there. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. All right. Still wants to roll the other way. Hold on. I'm working with natural daylight, so I apologize if it seems a little dark, but if I turn my lights on, it's going to be glary, glary. Yes. Okay. We're going to look at the drills. Um, it does have scalloped edges, so you don't have to worry about fraying. I've never had one of their kits fray on me. Um, crinkly noise. All right. I'm really interested. Where's that inventory sheet? Okay. So on the inventory sheet, you're going to see the special drills. The LZs are crystals. Then, of course, you've got your ABs here. It comes with two ABs. I'm sorry, three ABs. One, two, three. Three crystals. And then I don't know what the YG stands for. Number two, I think that's the larger uh, drill that goes in his eye. And then D13. I think these are the glow in the darks. The three. We're going to find out. Going to find out. Just going to put that right here so I can reference. All right, here we go. All right, yeah, I'm so excited. Uh, glow in the dark drills, I am here for it. Okay, so this is A05. So this is the number two on the canvas. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's a large blue, large blue crystal. Yes. And I'm pretty sure, yes, that is going to go right in the middle of his eye right there. And then, is that the only place that there is one? All right, yeah, it looks like number two, the only one is in his eye. So they gave you one, two, three, six, just in case. All right, awesome. Okay. And we've got all of these special, let me pull these out. These are D13. Okay. So you've got a blue, a green, and then 
see if I can do those. Blue, a green, and then a really pretty purple for special crystals. All right, let's see where this goes. We've got 64. 64 is, yes. Okay, let me show you here on the canvas. So the purple one. See the hourglasses here, these purple hourglasses? The larger ones? That's where those are gonna go. Um, I think there's some up here. Right there, right there. Don't mind my nail, I broke a nail. And right there. So yeah, those are the purple ones. And then the green one, D13, is the up arrow, okay? Let me show you here. There's an up arrow there. There's an up arrow there. Over here on the left side, that green up arrow. And these are larger than your normal drills. Yep, they're up in the top. There, there, there. So that's gonna be really pretty. They're sprinkled throughout. Just trying to give you an idea. 66 is the um, like diagonal, the, the pretty blue one. That is the diagonal. So the bigger diagonal looking shape right there, right there, right there. Okay. All right. Okay. So those are the larger shaped ones. All right, and then we've got glow in the dark. Okay, so the YGs are the glow in the dark. So let me pull the YGs out. Those are the, the regular size crystal. It looks like we've got, yeah, two glow in the dark. Okay, 61 is a pink color. Ah, okay, look, look at these glow in the darks, y'all. I'm in daylight, so you're not going to be able to see them glow in the dark, but look at that. That's the pink one, and then you've got a, I guess it's like a white, a white one. Okay, camera. It hates me. Okay, so the pink one, if you look on the bottom part of the canvas, these pink symbols. Anywhere you see the pink, that's where the glow in the dark is going to go. It's down here in the bottom of his tail. Yep. So it's all in like this area here. You see the pink. And then the 62, um, that one's going to be harder to see, but there are quite a few of those. So if you see, they're just like blank spots on the canvas. See those? It's just the white spots. That's where all that white, all that white space, especially in the moon. The moon's going to be nothing but glow in the dark, y'all. Woo! Okay. Awesome, awesome. Okay. Yay, I'm excited. Excited for that. Okay, these are your crystals. So 59 is the purple Tease. All right, let me zoom in a little bit. Okay. Purple tease. Or the sideways tease. That sounds bad. Um, it's down here in this area. And then, um, hmm. I'm looking. Let's see here. Oh, it's up here. There aren't a whole lot of these up here. Over here, right there. So basically, they're wherever the hourglass, the special drill hourglasses, they're around those. Okay. So yeah, that was the purple sparkler, or crystal, I'm sorry. Um, 58 is the gold. 
Uh, that is the letter M. See the pretty gold and that's the blue one. It's gonna be so shiny. All right, the gold one is all down here. Where you see the letter M. So I can see that anywhere that's the letter M. So it looks like it's gonna be all through here, here, over here, all throughout here. So that'll be nice, nice. And then the blue one, like the aqua, the real pretty aqua. Uh, that one is going to be, do, do, do. All right, it must be three o'clock. I hear my neighbor's bass again. Good Lord. Um, let's see, I'm looking. I'm looking, okay over here basically all throughout here and the branch here all all throughout the branch of the tree in the top uh, I don't see any on the bird itself so it looks like it's going to be focused in this area here awesome all right and then we've got some ABs so we've got yeah, three ABs. Okay, we've got a real pretty like seafoam green AB. Uh, let's see, that is looks like an anchor. Looks like an anchor. Okay, that is going to be all throughout the bird. The aqua you see around the bird, especially around the outside. And there are some as well on the inside top part of the bird. Um, yeah, it looks like, yeah, it's, it's going to be around this area. Yep. Okay. And then 57 is a darker aqua AB. That is, that is also going to be on the inside of the burr and then throughout the branches here and around the moon. That's going to be amazing. All right. And then we have a real pale yellow um, AB. So that's going to be, yes, down here mixed in with the M. There's some here. Um, and then over here, some, some pale yellow ABs. Awesome. 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 This is exciting. This is exciting. And this is one that, like I said, it's not very large, so it shouldn't take a whole lot of time. I'm just really surprised with a canvas of this size that there's 66 colors. That's, that's wow. 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 Okay. Let me zoom back out again. Zoom back out again. Okay. So you get to see the whole thing. Absolutely love this though. It's great. I think it's going to look really good. I really do. Um, you've got the bird is close enough. You know, it's not too far away where, you know, the details are going to get, you know, washed out. It's just a really pretty image and it's not your, it's got a lot of, you know, not pastel colors, but real pretty colors. Um, and it's not too dark, which is also good. Um, it looks like the background here, what is that? That is the bow tie symbol. Let me see. Y'all, there is no 310 in this canvas. So that means the Raven is not 310. What is it then? Hold on. 3371, which is... 3371 is a very, very dark brown. So that's what color is going to be throughout the Raven. No 310. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. But I'm still trying to figure out the, the background color. It looks like it's going to be a bunch of different colors, but the main one is like a bow tie. 
3799. Let's see. Yeah. Another, this is a very dark gray. Very dark gray. So that's going to be your primary color in the background over here where the and there's some other there's some other colors mixed into that but that's the primary color so yay so there we have it raven moon from craftably artist is julia watkins please check out craftably like i said i'll have all the the information down below and if you want to use my affiliate codes um feel free um no pressure there at all just it's there to help new customers save money. If you're an existing customer, there is a link you can click on. Um, so yeah, check it out. And then also check out their new stuff. I am going to check out the paper quilling because it really interests me. It's something new. And I don't know if I'll get frustrated with it or not, but it's I think it's worth a try. So yay. All right, you guys, let me know in the comments down below if any of you purchased this kit, um, what you're working on. Um, and if you have purchased a Craftably kit and worked on it, what are your thoughts? Let me know. Let me know. Um, yeah, I think that's it. So why don't we go ahead and leave a moon emoji in the comments for all of my beautiful lurkers out there. Um, love each and every one of you. Uh, please hit that like button and subscribe. And I will see all of you again very soon. Bye, guys.